In Midtown neighborhoods, cleanup is now in its third full day. Fox 23's Preston Jones checked out the damage in the neighborhoods and talked to one man who lost his house from the storm. Hard hats, heavy equipment, and street curbs lined with debris. Dozens of tree cleanup workers are out in full force in Midtown. The walls are separating and it's leaning out and then the entire roof's like on the inside, the ceiling's bowing down. Tim Blair says his house near 36 in Sandusky is likely a total loss. My daughter's bedroom, the bed she was in, the roof is now on the bed. I mean, it's collapsed in. The tornado nearly flattened part of his home. Tim says he and his wife and his daughter barely made it out. The corner of the house was gone, so when I walked into her room, she was sitting up in bed looking up at the corner and you could just see the lightning and it was raining in the house. The damage is so extensive, workers had to bring out this large crane for cleanup after not one, but two trees fell on this house. Tim's car is also likely totaled. But it must have went through the windshield and I mean the hood was down to the tire. He gave me these photos of the damage. One of the tree trunks is nearly twice his height. It was hard to get out of the neighborhood once it happened. I mean, there's down power lines and then there was trees uh, to the south of us. A few blocks over, we found a mountain of tree limbs, another home with a large hole in the roof, and several more with patchwork already complete. Tim says his house and car might be gone, but he's grateful his family is safe and he has insurance. I'm just thankful we all got out. I mean, it could have been a lot worse. In Midtown, covering news that matters. I'm Preston Jones, Fox 23 News.